I've had a hairy cell leukemia. Hairy cell leukemia is a cancer of the blood and bone marrow. This rare type of leukemia gets worse slowly or does not get worse at all. The disease is called hairy cell leukemia because the leukemia cells look hairy when viewed under a microscope. Danny Phillips has had cancer since he was 50 years old. Hairy cell leukemia will never totally disappear. It will always be a problem in his life. Danny has been treated three times within the last 10 years. No, I think maybe it came when I was in Vietnam from Agent Orange. Mm -hmm. So then that's how I got my disability through the VA. Okay. Uh, the doctors believe that he developed this disease through Agent Orange in the Vietnam War. Agent Orange was distributed over the crops so that the food supply would be diminished in that area. He served in Vietnam for two years. Did it affect your body? No, I was pretty lucky. I didn't, I didn't lose my hair. It didn't make me tired. My, it dropped my immune system. I, I couldn't be around nobody. Yeah. The first time, the second time they gave me a shot that brought my immune system up uh -huh. within, you know, like 48 hours, then I could be around people again. How do you think um, you would have reacted if you had lost your hair? But I don't think it would have bothered me, you know, mm -hmm. if I, being a lady or something like a woman, it would have probably, I know how my wife is in her hair, so. <laughs> <laughs> um. <clears throat> Unlike what Danny experienced, many people have noticeable side effects such as the swelling, loss of hair, and also chemotherapy makes the skin look ashy. Danny did not need to go through drastic measures to cover up the effects of chemotherapy, but many people do. Women especially have a hard time adjusting to their looks once chemotherapy begins. Look Good Feel Better is an organization that helps women combat the effects of chemotherapy. This organization has workshops all over the country to show women how to apply makeup the best way to cover up dark circles and pale skin. This organization does not just help women cover the effects, it also produces an aspect of self-worth and diminishes the feeling of loneliness. Another organization that helps men and women through this hard time is Locks of Love. Locks of Love asks people to donate their hair that they are getting cut to make wigs for cancer patients. Through these hard times, I believe that everyone needs a loving family to be with them. Danny Phillips has that. He has two beautiful daughters and three grandchildren. Also, he has many nieces and nephews, like me, who love him dearly. Love is all you need.